Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how to make a desktop table. So um, we're going to select our cube and hold the green arrow, press S, and we're going to bring it together, very close to each other. And then we can hit tab and go into edit mode. We're going to select our face and we're going to extrude this part, the top part of the, of the cube up. And we're going to hit E on your keyboard and bring it up a little bit just like that and now we're going to select the right side face and press E and bring it all the way over right here and then we're going to press E again and leave a little space just like that and make a little more space and do the same thing just like that and you can select them both from underneath press 3 on your number key that and then press E and bring it all the way down until it lines up with the other one then we can go ahead and add a loop cut by doing that you hold control R and bring it all the way back to the back of the table and then we can go back to face we can go ahead and extrude that from there this side of the table and then now he can add two loop cuts there and add one more loop cut like that and a loop cut right there like that you can go back to face and you can select them press E and bring them all the way over now you can go ahead um, we're gonna add another loop cut holding control R and bring it all the way to the tip of the table and then just adding one more right behind it not too close. Now we could go ahead and select face. Now we can select those faces, press E, and extrude it as high as you need. Um, for this top one, I'm going to press Z, and I'm going to unselect. I'm going to unselect this one, the bottom one. There we go. And now that leaves us with just this one. And now we can put this one in its place. Just like that. There. Now we can go ahead. First, we're going to select the edges. Press E and extrude it out just a little bit. I'm going to hold on the red arrow and bring it out this way so it could be even like that. You could get a plane, bring it down, And there you have your desktop table. You can even add a texture on it if you want to. I'm going to add a texture that I like to use. To unwrap your texture, select all of it by pressing L or A. Click U on your um, keyboard and click unwrap. There's a lot of different textures that you can use for your table. Hope you like this tutorial and I'll be back with another one. Goodbye. Hi guys, this is the final render. Um, yeah, and if you liked it, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And yeah, have a good day.